it's been a interesting day I um, got up this morning and loaded my my Harley onto the trailer to take it to the uh, to the welder over in Jasper and uh, so I uh, I had a I had a thing I wanted done um, down here in the front there's um where my footrest goes you can, it goes right up in here um, it had me too close let me see if I can do this um, as uh, as you're riding your leg is sitting here against this breather and the peg was in here um, it was down here in this area here and your foot was always on out on the end of the of the cruising peg so I um, took it over there and the guy was going to weld it all up. Well, he couldn't get to it today, but he kept the part over there and he's going to weld it tonight after sh after work. And uh, let me come around on the other side over here. He, because uh, I've got the sun right in, throwing shadows everything, everywhere. Um, he uh, he kept it over there, and uh, so anyhow. Got back home, and uh, the um, the lawnmower people call me. I put my lawnmower um, in, in the shop um, last Friday, I believe it was. And he called me today, and he said, well, I'm going to have your lawnmower ready this afternoon. <laughs> and so uh, here I've got this loaded up. And I thought, oh, I said, can I come and get it tomorrow? And he said, oh, sure. So uh, tomorrow i got to run back over to Jasper, get my part that they're welding out for me, and get it installed back on the bike, get home, get this unloaded, and then go to Hayden, Alabama to uh, go get my lawnmower. <laughs> Man, I'll tell you. Uh... It's a, it is a, one thing after another. That's life on the farm. Oh, I forgot. On the way back home from the welder, um, I stopped over and paid my homeowner's insurance, took the over to the vet, got him a flea and tick pill, and also got him an anti-itching shot. So we're all good to go. I hope we can sit down and rest now.